MCC December update has been delayed officially until next year. Stay tuned throughout the video to understand all the little details. How's it going everybody? It's Kevin here once again giving you another news information update video involving Halo. If you like these news information videos, please make sure to tap that like button as it lets me know you want to see some more content like this. Leave a comment down below what you thought about the video and the delay on this update. And if you're new to the channel and want to stay up to date with anything Halo related, please make sure to tap subscribe with the bell to keep you notified whenever we do anything awesome on the channel, which is going to be every time so let's get right into the video here so this december update was supposed to bring some brand new additions to the mcc to really help you know bring it to the you know modern era kind of thing uh, especially bringing the modern aiming into mcc which is a major component of, of this patch update and i was super excited about it but it's going to get delayed and there was even a new uh ce skull that was going to be put into the game as well and those who participated in the mcc insider uh you know test run of this patch was going they were all going to receive the ugly sweater nameplate which does look pretty awesome that's kind of the reason why i jumped in and played it as well because i really wanted that nameplate and sadly all that's gonna have to be delayed until later in jan so here's the issue with it said a bug that was actually flagged by some of our community insiders who were helping review a pre-release patch the issue involves some corrupted content and a scenario which can break the UI flow, impede a party's ability to play a matchmaking together, and eventually crash the game, which clearly isn't the type of experience we want to ship. 100% understandable on that one because, you know, obviously, MCC has not had a big uh, or necessarily a good rap when it comes to quality, when it comes to the content. Uh, of it working properly so when 343 updates the game and it's you know some people are having issues with it people go oh my god mcc is still broken oh my god which rightfully so could be a little angry but it's some i think right now at this point it's a little bit over exaggeration outrage sketch had this to say on the recent social stream about the mcc patch being delayed uh long story short we actually had to hit pause on that update we had hoped to release it today but unfortunately uh, a late breaking issue arose that we did not feel was a good experience for players so that means the update is delayed realistically we don't have a date yet but it would have to be sometime after the ugc halo classic which is the second week of january so i guess would be uh kind of mid to late yeah. january but once the team comes back from holidays oh uh, my God, how did i miss that they will dive in and figure out the quickest way to bring that content and the update to everyone so yeah, this is going to be a full month delay when it comes to this p update. And, you know, it's kind of understandable, especially with the UGC event coming up. You don't want to drop like a major update, especially when it comes to aiming, like they're going to do for Halo 3 with the modern aiming. And we'll also all the ga other games as well. And to drop that like maybe like a week before the uh, major release, it seems like it would, wouldn't be the best thing to do when it comes to having a, a professional you know, co competitive Halo 3 tournament with money on the line to just throw a patch out there last minute. It just, it wouldn't be good for the players. So I understand why 343 would want to delay this patch. Now me, I'm kind of personally bummed because I really want that ugly sweater nameplate to be rather festive toward the season when it comes to uh, December holiday season. And we're not gonna get that until probably late January. So that's a real bummer. It's gonna be out of season kind of thing. And so it, it kind of ruins the, the fun of having the nameplate, right? But don't worry. Us players who played at least 12 matches in the MCC Insider play session are going to get a small consolation of the ice nameplate, which is cool. At least I got something. Uh, I mean, I don't really care much for the ice nameplate, but it's, um, you know, it's something, you know, and uh, it's something maybe a little bit more unique for us to have for insider players who took the time out of the day to play the game and help you know, release this patch. Thankfully, we do these insider updates, and so then uh, we can catch problems like this before just releasing to the public. That's the whole point of the insider program, and probably the same reason why they're going to do the same flighting program when it comes to Halo Infinite, probably coming in 2019. We're still kind of waiting around for the content browser update as well and also some update when it comes to some forge maps that were mentioned previously as well that's been a few months since that was mentioned so uh if you guys want to stay up to date with anything going on with the mcc please make sure to follow the channel there i'll keep you up to date as soon as any kind of information happens when it comes to that stuff uh well, that's pretty much all we had to say in the video right now there's a delay with the mcc update 
uh, your honor naming, your new CE school, your nameplate, and all that kind of stuff are gonna have to wait to probably late next month. That's the update, guys. I really do appreciate you coming by and checking out the channel. If you like this video, please remember to tap that like button. Let me know if you want to see some more content like this. Leave a comment down below how you feel about this news. Obviously, it's not good, but you know, me personally, I have no problem waiting for good content rather than having to something just ship something that's buggy and broken. You want to make sure it's good. And uh, guys, want to stay up to date with anything going on with the MCC, Halo 5, or Infinite, please make sure to tap that subscribe button with the notification. Keeps you up to date with anything on the channel. If you miss any content from me or new to the channel, check out the videos on the screen right over here. And I'll catch you all in the next video. Peace out.